Points for the men's 50 metres butterfly S3. Ionis Kostakis for Greece goes in lane three. Next to Dimitro Vino Radetz, uh, one of the most successful swimmers here at these championships. The world record holder in this event. Can Mikhail Fredriksen make an improvement and challenge the great Ukrainian swimmer? Going in from the side, Alex Shechnik. Well, this is a combined event. And Alex Shechnik, he is an S2 swimmer. And he is the world record holder in the S2 class. So we have two world records to watch out for. And that's the S2 swimmer going for his own world record mark, 121.71. Vino Radetz world record for the S3 class, 56.94. So... We will have only one set of medals, even though it is a combined classification. But we do have world records to look out for. Vino Radetz being held there. In fact, that's Kostakis there in lane number three. Vino Radetz being held face down. It's a test already as this start is delayed. That cannot be helping the Ukrainian swimmer. Kostakis flips over straight away. He had a good idea there. He was able to take some air in, waiting for that start. Vino Radetz into his stroke. We'll watch out for Stechnik up there at the top of your screen. But a good start from Mikhail Fredriksson, the 22-year-old from Sweden. Now I thought he may well challenge Vino Radetz, but Vino Radetz has been on great form at these championships. A handful of gold medals already to his name, half a dozen gold medals to the Ukrainian, the great Ukrainian swimmer. And the only one to challenge him in the early stages, Fredriksen has gone by the wayside now. The only thing we're looking out for is the world record mark, 56.94. That's the record mark. Can Vino Radetz get inside it? It's looking good for the Ukrainian. It's going to be a record, surely. It is 55.78. Vino Radetz breaks his own world record by almost a second, by over a second, in fact. And the silver, well, very close for the silver medal position. Fredriksen just gets it, the Swede. And in third position, Kostakis, just 0.3 of a second behind. Let's keep an eye on the clock now. Chechnys chasing his own mark of 121.71. The swimmer from Slovenia, 125.37. Not today for Alice Sechnik from Slovenia. There's the start. Fredriksen, no use of his arms at all, but he does get some propulsion from his legs. There's Vino Radetz being held by his coach. Straight into that stroke there, the Ukrainian swimmer. Keeping his head down, an excellent butterfly style. This man has no power in his legs whatsoever and limited use of his arms. You just see the effect that his disability has as his hands enter the water there. But Fino Radetz comes up behind Fredriksen. A great start from the Swede, and that helped immensely for him to claim the silver medal. But Fino Radetz comes home for a new world record a gold medal and a world championship title. We are waiting for confirmation of the result. Vino Radetz, a world champion as it stands. We may well have a disqualification here. Hopefully it will not affect the medal positions. Just waiting for that official result as the swimmers exit the water. There's a disqualification on the scoreboard there. Alice Seshnik, the S2 swimmer, has been listed as a DQ. Just see on the scoreboard. So that DQ is confirmed. 
then it will not affect the medal positions. The top three will remain as they are, Vino Radetz, Fredriksen and Tostakis. The result is confirmed. Vino Radetz takes gold in a new world record time. Fredriksen the bronze, Tostakis the bronze. Fred <laughs> Let me start that again. Vino Radetz takes gold for Ukraine. Fredriksen the silver and Kostakis the bronze.